you have an uneven skin tone, discoloration, hyperpigmentation scars, or any dark part around your body, this video is for you. I've noticed that I've not really talked about it, and a lot of you have actually come to my DM Instagram asking me how you'll be able to actually get rid of this uneven skin tone. So please, if you are interested in knowing how, do not go anywhere. Stay back, sit, relax, and watch. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Choma Akujizi and here on my channel I share skincare tips, I make product reviews and also do DIYs. So if this is something you love, please click the subscription button to be part of the family. So now, what is an uneven skin tone? An uneven skin tone is called hyperpigmentation. That is, it is an irregular darkening of the skin. The cause is when there is an overproduction of melanin that is the pigment that is responsible for hair and skin color so how is uneven skin tone caused like what are those factors that can actually give you an uneven skin tone because the truth is that we are we are so exposed to that we do not even know what can actually cause that uneven skin tone first one that could actually cause it is sun exposure like when your skin is so exposed to the sun the sun will tan your skin and to give you that irregular darkening of your skin on that area that your skin is exposed to the sun another one is an hormone like melasma maybe your your skin is actually reacting to something that you've taken like a medication or a drug it could actually react and start giving you that excessive melanin on your skin another one is post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation this post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation this is the darkening of the skin as a result of injury when you have an injury on your skin and it's then it goes it is definitely actually a deep one it would actually leave a scar there these are some of the things that could actually cause hyperpigmentation or it could be creams that you have used before and maybe you or your skin is actually reacting to the cream it would actually leave a dark mark or dark spot on your body. When some of these things that I just said now actually cause or give you that hyperpigmentation that you have. So one of the mistakes that we make is that when we have scars or hyperpigmentation on our body, we now feel like the only solution for us to do is to start using whitening products and bleaching products. Now venture into using whitening product, bleaching products. What do they do? They only tend to give a long term problem a long-term skin problem on your skin and it, will, it is not even saying it's not healthy and they would also make the the scars or the hyperpigmentation worsening this issue of uneven skin tone hyper hyperpigmentation dark spot discoloration is one of the will i say it's a very very common problem that a lot of people are facing right now like almost 80 percent just 80 percent or a lot of people are actually going through this uneven skin a lot of people have tried a lot of things like i said from the causes that i mentioned it could be injury it could be a lot of things it could be creams it could even be drugs that you've even taken inside your body so a lot of people are actually acting to this having an uneven skin tone is not something that you should be helpless worried or worried sick about so that is why in this video i'm going to be listing out and explaining to you and also recommending to you the right products and very very good safe skincare products that would actually help for your own even skin tone to give you an even skin tone i'm going to tell you the skincare product to use the steps and how you can actually clear or get rid of your own even skin tone discoloration or dark part the first thing you should know is that when treating an uneven skin tone, actives should be incorporated in your skincare routine. Like there are some actives that you should incorporate that you must not miss out in your skincare routine. So I'm going to actually be listing out. I'm also going to put it on the screen here for you so you're going to see it. The first active here is alpha and butene. Like alpha and butene should not be omitted in your skincare routine the second one is niacinamide like you should have niacinamide you should have a product that would have niacinamide in your skincare routine the third one here is kojic acid kojic acid too should also be incorporated in your skincare routine the fourth one is vitamin c vitamin c is also important also and should 
also be incorporated in your skincare routine the fifth one is salicylic acid you must make sure that you all the products so that would contain salicylic acid the sixth one is liquorice extract and the seventh one is vitamin a which is also known as retinol okay like what are the steps of having an uneven skin tone the first thing you should know is that you should always make sure that you exfoliate your skin exfoliating your skin helps to remove dead skin cells and helps to generate a new skin cell turn over so just imagine now you have an uneven skin tone and for a month you've not actually exfoliated your skin and you not get a new product and you're using it come on like you would not really see the impact of that product on your skin and those dead skin cells will stay there and give you that hyperpigmentation dark mark on your skin so it is also important that you exfoliate your skin and when you're exfoliating your skin chemical exfoliant is is it's more preferable to use than the physical ones because this particular one they are uh, in liquid form they get to actually penetrate deeply inside your skin they work faster like you should have chemical exfoliants that have lactic acid or glycolic acid so like i'm just gonna list out two for you so the first one now is two percent bha polar's choice the second one here i'm going to be recommending for you too is the ordinary glycolic toner this particular one is so rampant, like it's one is so popular and yes, this is the ordinary glycolic acid when it comes to treating dark marks and any form of discoloration, even under your arm or anywhere on your face, trust me guys, this particular the ordinary is going to do so well for you on your skin. The second step now is you should use good products on your skin like for baiting and also cleansing your skin. When you're using your chemical exfoliant, don't also forget or omit moisturizing body wash or bath soaps that would help to actually restore your skin and also give it that glowing skin that you want and also aid in the repairing of your skin. So one good moisturizing soap is Dove Olay Palm Olive Moisturizing Body Wash. And at night, you know, the reason why I'm breaking it down like this is because a lot of you ask me, okay, at night, what should I use? During the day, what should I use? I'm not breaking it down for it because if you really want to actually get that on even skin to my I feel like at night is when you use all the products that you don't get to use during the day because of work and your exposure to the sun. So at night, Koji San Lightning Soap. This soap is a like this soap is a top notch. Like for me, this soap is hundred percent of a hundred percent. As if you are able to lay your hands on the original one, this soap is going to lighten up every uneven skin tone that you have on your skin. Trust me, it will lighten everything up. This soap is so good for clearing dark marks. It's so good for clearing discoloration, and it will also help to brighten and also lighten up your skin. So, and it works as a cleanser. During the day, use a moisturizing soap, and at night, now use your Koji Sun Lightning Soap. Then we're moving on to body creams that we use to moisturize your skin. Now, moisturizing to even tone this body lotion that equally moisturizes your skin that also has little bits of exfoliating properties in your skin the first one here is the CeraVe SA cream I'm going to leave it here this CeraVe SA cream is so good for moisturizing and it also helps to restore skin barrier the other one here is this particular Eucerian Urea Repair Plus 30% urea cream. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right, but this cream is so so good. I actually know someone who the, is using this particular product and it's so so good on her skin when it comes to moisturizing and repairing the skin. And the third one here, because this product could be actually very very expensive, that was why I added this set eyes, cranberry, and repairing body lotion this body lotion is going to naturally brighten up your skin and it also helps to repair the skin i added this one here for you guys just in case you are able to get the CeraVe and this is a weird um, body lotion you could try out this scent and it's so so nice and going to do so well for your skin if you want to repair your skin now for your face 
It could be using a Koji sand. If you have any hyperpigmentation on your face, you could be using a Koji sand for your face. This hand is so, so effective, trust me. But if you can't get Koji sand, you can use Ashanti. If you can lay your hands on the original Ashanti bar soap, it is also going to cleanse your face and help to fade away dark spots and dark marks on your skin. But I feel like the Koji sand soap is going to do more and more for you so you can try the koji sand soap and another one is for lighten up your skin you would want to use serums like serums that have niacinamide and ambotine in it this niacinamide and ambotine are so good for for brightening up dark hyperpigmentation dark spots scars and to actually give you and full skin so so make sure that you don't when you're using when you're getting serums serums you should make sure that you incorporate serums with niacinamide alpha and butene and vitamin c in your skincare routine so i'm going to be adding this particular cream actually a face cream this ambi skincare face cream if you know my who she's actually a light brown skin person so she used to have dark spots and hyperpigmentation she was actually telling me that wow trauma this and this skin fade cream actually did magic on her face so if you you're using your cleanser then you're using the serum trust me also try and get this ambi skincare fade cream it would help to clear away dark spots have any hyperpigmentation or acne scars that you have on your skin and the fourth step i don't know if it's the first step make sure that you apply your sunscreen because it's just going to be a waste it's just like you're pouring water inside baskets why would you use all these products and still go out in the sun without using a sunscreen it is so so wrong like why are you wasting your time and money make sure that you lock up everything with a sunscreen and reduce your um your exposure to the sun a bit not like you won't go out but you know what to do right you could wear glasses you could wear glass shades you could also use umbrella finally the last step to getting an uneven skin tone is be patient i know you'll be like really patient i really needed to add this yes i felt like it was necessary because i needed to tell you guys that there is no quick fix for an uneven skin tone there is no quick way a successful skin brightening can actually take up to like two three months when you're using the right product so you're not using all this bleaching or whitening products can take up to two or two to three months consistency and continuous use of it so, so what am i trying to say is that if you really want to actually get that even skin tone that you want you need to be consistent and you need to keep using the products rightly and you need to be patient and doing all these steps and carrying out all these steps trust your skin in no time is going to be an even skin tone so guys we've come to the end of this video i hope you really got you guys really found this video really helpful if you have any questions come down to the comment section i'm gonna be there to answer all your questions in the comment section and i'm going to leave links in my description box um my description box where you can get any of these skincare products there but if you have anything like you want to add or you want to recommend to or you want you, you want me to also recommend any products come down to comment section and leave it there don't forget to like this video don't forget to comment don't forget to subscribe if you've watched me up to this point i am not subscribed please do have to subscribe and for my subscribers i love you all thank you for showing so much support and love to me and don't forget to also check out my previous video and until then i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye guys